What up, Make a Day? It's your boy, Kareem, a.k.a. Mr. 100 Likes. How you guys doing? <coughs> wow. Let's get to it. Yeah, I'm under the weather. I've been under the weather for a little minute. Uh, been sick. Got the flu. Um, but I want to uh, get into it real quick, right? Uh, Miles Turner was on the Woj podcast, and um, he talked about joining the Lakers, and I You've been you know, hearing it for on, months. On, so I'll ask on, uh, I touched, you. I touched on a um, situation before about um, Miles Turner, about that he thought he was going to join the Lakers. I told you guys this. So this is Miles Turner uh, talking about joining the Lakers. You've been hearing it for months. So I'll ask you, if you're the Lakers, would you do the two picks? <laughs> would you do the two picks? Oh, uh, that's that's such an intriguing question. <laughs> at that, um, I think personally, you know, when you look at this business of the league and you know, knowing the landscape of the league, you know, you have to go off your future, right? And think, we we all know picks are so valuable in this league. And someone like myself, I'm heading into the last year of my you know my deal, and you want to make sure you know you're getting a return, you know, for your assets, right? So, you know, if I'm the Lakers, I take a very hard look at this with the position that you're in. You know, I know what I can provide for a team, you know, my, my leadership, my shot blocking, you know, my three-point ability, and just my ability to make plays out there on the floor, and I take a very long look at it. But as far as pulling the trigger, you know, that's uh, – I get paid to shoot. Now, you know, I'm not made to, to make these calls, so I, I couldn't answer that. <laughs> You've been hearing it for months. That's Miles Turner. Um, I want to know what you guys think about that, man. Um. He took about things. He said his leadership, uh, ability, shot blocking, and three point shooting, and things like that. What he could do to help the Lakers. Um, what would you guys do? Um, you know, he, like he said, he has a contract coming up. He's going to be a free agent, and that's 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 a whole another level of, of, you know, what it's going to be, and how much the Lakers, you know, emphasize Anthony Davis playing the center, you know, how if they prioritize Anthony Davis playing center, do it make sense to them getting a center like Miles Turner, who going at minimum gonna at least be a fifteen million dollar a year player. Do you want your fifteen million dollars uh on a center position that you might not uh, play much and you feel that's not your your best lineup? It's a lot of uh, things need to be answered. But I always said, I always tell you guys, I always liked the, the Pacers deal because I just don't like how the Pacers come at the lake as far as what they want. But what Miles Turner and Buddy Hill, I always I like kind of feel safe with that more so than anything. Cause I always said the Lakers could pick up guys, they could then try to go get you know a guy like Mo Harkless, but like a wing defender. Uh, pick up maybe a Josh Jackson or, you know, Jay Crowder, something like that to, 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 for the wing. But I just feel Buddy Hill, constant movement all around. Buddy Hill moves all day. I think that's like a plus. His, his release is so quick. Then Miles Turner, his shot blocking is, is big. Like that, that shot blocking move is just crazy down there. So, um, and, you know, he could roll off picks and get, get, get lobbed and things like that. So, <clears throat> tell me what you guys think. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Let's get the subscribers up. Peace.